If there's one thing that can be said about San Antonio, it's that this city loves basketball. And in 1981, UTSA finally brought Division I men's and women's college hoops to the Alamo City. Men's and women's basketball just started in 1981. But just like this university, our athletic department is so young, right? That 1981 really isn't that, that um, long ago and to start an athletic program. But in that short amount of time from you know, winning conference championships to going to NCAA tournaments, that, that we have had some really good years and are continuing to build on that. UTSA would claim its first title in 1988 by winning the Transamerica Conference Tournament. That team would go on to the NCAA tournament, where they suffered a narrow defeat to an Illinois squad that boasted four future NBA players. Led by their own future NBA player, Devin Brown, the men's team would make it back to March Madness in 1999, playing the eventual national champion Connecticut Huskies in the first round. The men's team made two more appearances in the big dance, once in 2004 after a court-storming win over Stephen F. Austin in the Southland Conference Championship game, and again in 2011 when the Roadrunners posted their first ever NCAA tournament victory over Alabama State. Not to be outdone, the women's basketball team has also made some postseason noise. The women won the Southland Conference Tournament in 2008 and 2009. In their second NCAA tournament appearance, the number 15 Roadrunners nearly pulled off one of the biggest upsets in the history of women's college basketball as they took number two seed Baylor to overtime before falling 87 to 82. In this haven of hoops, UTSA has provided its fair share of memorable March moments.